talking about this phenomenon, I would just to say briefly that this is according to many scientists, to many archaeologists and visitors, the biggest archaeological site on the world and it has potential to be the biggest discovery of this century. In April of 2005, I first came to this little town of Visoko in the central Bosnia. The reason had nothing to do with the pyramids. I came to visit the local museum and I saw this hill with a regular shape four sides, triangular faces, very obvious corners, and when I put the compass to it and I found out that the sides perfectly matched the cardinal points, east, west, north and south, I immediately knew that I have the pyramid in front of me. But those two facts alone, the geometry and perfect orientation, were enough for me to conclude that this was a man-made structure which I named the Bosnian Pyramids of the Sun and the Moon. But later on, thanks to the satellite screening and images, thanks to the topographical maps, we realized that the complex is much bigger. We added three more structures, which we call the Bosnian Pyramids of the Love, Dragon and Earth. There is possibility of two more pyramids in the valley. Then there is a complex of the tumulus and the underground tunnel labyrinth which consists of tens of kilometers of tunnels, chambers, underground lakes and so on. My name is Vinko Totic, I am a movie maker, director and producer of my first feature-length movie, Mystery of the Bosnian Pyramids. People showed up from six continents, from South America, Colombia, from North America, from US and Canada, from Africa, from countries like Egypt, from Australia and New Zealand, from Asia, from Malaysia, from Pakistan, from Bangladesh, and of course from Europe. Croatia, Serbia, Slovenia, Macedonia, Bosnia, Italy, Hungary, Holland, Denmark, United Kingdom, Ireland, Romania, Russia, and other countries. And uh, in 2010, we have had about 500 volunteers. I think this is an amazing number. It's been a life transformative experience over here. I was like a kram. Um, and I'm very happy. Very happy. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> I believe that in the past there was um, like a, a past civilization over here that was uh, very much in touch with nature. Ono što je unutra to je napolje, ono što je napolje to mora biti unutra. Znači traganjem za ovim dubinama, traganjem za ovim energetskim potencijalima, najvratnije ćemo doći do svog nekog unutrašnjeg potencijala koji je but it's also finally a pyramid structure and they have the alignment to north south and different tunnel system so um, it will be very interesting what the future brings out about these um, places so I think this story will continue <laughs> and as your uh, archaeologist from Italy told me yesterday that they wrote already from Italy that she doesn't have to come back 
I understood completely. No, of course I don't miss the academy that is telling me, okay, don't come back because you're crazy, you're wasting your time. All these people who are judging without ever being here, how can they consider themselves as scientists? Oni ne podržavaju osnovna ljudska prava, kamoli projekte i šta ja znam, mislim, stvarno nema smisla govoriti o njima. So if they recognize your pyramids as original, 10,000 years, 30,000 years, the missing link was what was in between. They should give an answer, but they cannot give an answer. So it's more easy to say this is all natural and uh, leave us alone. And then the media will not report about it. And, but the reality <coughs> is different and our history is different. Two very important things that we could hear today was that he was the first one who really detected the energy beam on the top of the Bosnian pyramid of the sun. And second, that the strength of the energy beam is getting higher as it moves away from the pyramid. Next one. This is the scanning and these are the tunnel systems which are definitely inside the sun pyramid. The second uh, International Scientific Conference on Bosnian Pyramids is over. I'm very satisfied. The first one clearly said, what you have here in Bosnian Valley of the Pyramids is the archaeological phenomenon. Now, three years later, with all this measured and detected energy phenomena, it is clear that we are on a good track to discover the purpose of the Bosnian Pyramids. Not only that the uh, discovery of Bosnian pyramids changed the way we view the ancient history, but also it has a potential to change our future. I hope that our uh, research might be a big help for Sam to find the right entrances to the pyramid, which uh, would save him a lot of time and a lot of money. And I wish him all the best and I'm sure it will be finally one of the most important or maybe the most important archaeological discovery of our century. Just to remind you that this is my first feature-length movie. Out of 70 hours of good quality footage, I brought down movie to 88 minutes. It's almost last phase of post-production. So as you can see, the movie is almost here. It's almost done, but it's not. This is first time that I applied for any funding, even though I've been working on this project two years. I've been in Bosnia three times for extended period of time, filming, capturing, editing, and now it's time to bring it up technically and present it to the world, this amazing phenomenon this amazing discovery about the Bosnian pyramids.